Thankfully, Harold Levy didn't press charges against me. He probably didn't want the police searching any more than they had to. It confirms my suspicion that Harold is up to no good, but I can't convince Catherine to investigate further. Am I wasting my time watching my neighbors? Mrs. Dower is old and frail. Is she even capable of such a thing as attacking a man and taking his child? I made Mr. Morgan an impossible promise, but if I stopped now, it was all for nothing. There's that boy. I'm not zoomed in enough to see. So this is the police's base of operations. By the sounds of it, they've forgotten all about Charlotte May. There's a light on downstairs. Mrs. Doer is still awake. And here I am, spying on an elderly lady. Might have to zoom in for a closer look. Mrs. Doe's home once looked out onto a field of dahlia flowers. Her husband built the manor house with shipping company money. Now it's surrounded by all of this. Now this is interesting. What is she doing under there? It looks like she's hiding something. But what is it? Well, that floorboard is my first port of call. It's too far away. That is probably just a cat. What could she be doing in the basement? And how did she get down there? This is getting stranger by the minute. Might have to zoom in a little further. Mrs. Doer's bedroom. That big house all to herself, and she only lives in one room. How age punishes us. I'm not zoomed in enough to see. 
All of the searches for Charlotte May start from the crow's nest. Perhaps I should have signed up. Some good my chair would have been in the Pinewoods. I'd give anything to know what's in that box. Maybe it has something to do with what was hidden under the floorboard. That's my second port of call. Now she seems to be doing something. Dear God, that, that's not her at all. Mrs. Doe is in danger. Unless they're working together. I need to get a photograph of the intruder. You there! Stop what you're doing at once! I said stop! You won't get away with this! Whomever I saw leave Mrs. Doe's home left in a hurry. Let's hope they don't return. Now, to break in without being caught. I hope to God Mrs. Doe has come to bed. Could be useful. Hello, Mrs. Doa. Mrs. Doe used something to pry it up. I should have been more prepared. There must be something down here I can use. It looks too hot to touch. I 
hope none of my neighbors are watching me right now. What would they say? Makes my small flat look like a prison cell. the police. No, the intruder will be long gone by now. It's up to me. Basement. Damn this wheelchair. That's the box Mrs. Doer carried in. It's empty. And what are you looking at?
still water. Let's hope that worked. Now, if I can find the sweet spot. This bone inlay is very ornate. Old, too. It's too dull to reflect. Just as well. I haven't slept in days. It smells old and dusty. It hasn't been used recently. detail is outstanding. And what's this? A family tree. What on earth are you doing in my house, Mr. Conway? Ah, uh, uh, Mrs. Doa. It's Lady Doa to you. We live in polite society, last I checked. Lady Doa, uh, let me explain. It had better be a bloody good explanation. <sighs> Go on. There was an intruder in your house. I'll say. Uh, I believed they were here for Charlotte May. I believed you were in danger, so I came over to help. And where is this so-called intruder now, Mr. Conway? I trust you tried to apprehend him. Sadly, no. So it's just you and your word, then. Your daughter is a police officer, Mr. Conway. <laughs> you should have called her. I believed your danger to be too... immediate, my lady. I was concerned for your safety. You can cut that nonsense out right away. If you were concerned about me, then you would have knocked on my door or checked on me. Instead, I come out to find you at this ungodly hour prying up my floorboards. This is clearly a matter for the police. And how, may I ask, did you know to look under there? Look, I can see you don't suffer fools, my lady, so I'll just come out. No need, Mr. Conway. You've been spying on all of us from your window. Not very subtle, if I do say so. Uh, very uh, astute. But please, if I may, I merely came over to ask you a few questions. I suppose you want to know why I stored my belongings under the floor. I want to know why they're all children's belongings. <laughs> Charlotte May. I'm not given to the kidnapping of young girls. Why don't you just tell me what you were doing, then? <sighs> Very well. For the past few months, things have been going missing from my home. Bits and bobs, really, but as you can see, the simplest of things in this house would fetch a pretty penny. Last week, it was one of my porcelain dolls. I'm of the suspicion that my maid is stealing from me. So I hid my most cherished positions under my floorboards. I've had that silver mirror you just found since I was a small child. It's worth more than daily of you itself. Regrettably, my late husband and I... Well, we don't have a child of our own to lead these things to. I see now that I should have hidden them better.
Fetch a pretty penny. Do you think your maid is stealing purely for the money? I couldn't tell you. But it wouldn't be a first, would it? I'm trying to decide whether money is a strong enough motive to abduct a child. Seems to be a theme going around here. I thought I knew her. <laughs> if you'd asked me a few weeks ago, I would have said there was no way. But now... Who is your maid, if you don't mind me asking? Well, I say maid. She is a glorified cleaner. Shirley Downs. Shirley? Your neighbour? Yes. She owns the pub next door. She needed a little extra cash, and I needed my house to stop falling apart. I see. Seemed like a good idea at the time. Has she cleaned her long? A handful of months. The upstairs, mainly. I have no interest in going up there these days. Too many memories, and I can only walk so far before my feet give in. Do you think Shirley would break into your home? The intruder I saw. Could it be her, or someone you know? You say you saw the intruder break in? Uh, well, out. They were picking the door, trying to lock it. Picking it? What does that mean? Oh, they had a... Trust me, they were up to no good with it. I gave Shirley a key. I'm certain she has no need to do such a thing. Lady Doa, would you allow me to search the upstairs of your property? I believe I may be able to shed some light on the situation, if you'd permit me. We should call the police, surely? Well, they haven't found Charlotte May yet, and they don't seem to be doing much about it. How about we postpone calling them for just a short while? I do say, how Machiavellian, Mr. Conway. You ask me to lie to the police. To your daughter, no less. Not at all. Just to postpone calling. In the pursuit of knowledge. Hmm. The stair lift. I believe it still works. There should be another wheelchair up there somewhere. My late husband's. Thank you. up there for a year or two now. You will share what you find? It would be my pleasure. Oh, and Mr. Conway, there's no electricity. You might want to use the lanterns. Now, to find out what our intruder was up to. <sighs> oh, 
these look like maritime telescopes, older than me. Is this open? I saw the intruder leave. Let's hope it stays that way. Another child's toy. there somewhere, or are you in here? I will catch you. I don't think I've seen Lady Dower smoke before now. Must be Shirley's. Now what do we have here? Lord Doa must have been a war hero. Let there be light. Oh, this has some weight to it. If I had something flat to slide down this drawer. Why on earth would they want to tear this painting? Shelley's been gathering valuables. Perhaps Lady Doa was right. This all sounds fancy. Mm-hmm. 
locked. Of course it is. The Doa Crest. Very fancy. from the other side. Looks like I need some kind of lever to turn this. Now, what's this? Twenty-second. Let's have another look. The telescope is pointed right at Mr. Morgan's house. Was she spying on Charlotte May? The 22nd was the night that Charlotte May was taken. Let's hear what she has to say. I wonder if it has anything to do with Seddon and Sons. Hmm. Could be the year. Seddon and Sons. I've seen that name. She said it could be the year, whatever that means. I'd better try to find it. Uh, 
I'm not zoomed in enough to see. Ah, there you are. Now what was Shirley doing with you? Now. By the sounds of it, she was trying to open something in this room. Lady Doa was right. Shirley's stealing from her. Now, where was I? Oh, for God's sake, Larry. I sent you home an hour ago. Not your shoe. <sighs> Idiot. What on earth was this Larry up to? Sounds like he was a drunken fool. Let's take a look at... Um... What the hell? What, what did she see? Charlotte May? Well, this is moments before the attack. Now, what was she looking at that she needed for this room? Good. Excellent. Thank you very much, Shirley Downs. Pete Hill Reserve. Well, at least Lord Doa had good taste. What on earth? Charlotte May! Charlotte, are you in there? How do I lift this? This makes things clear. Lord Deva was a hobbyist. Might help me force that lock open. Nothing useful in there. It's heavier than it looks.
There's no way I can untie this by hand. Did Lord Doa model all of these himself? so hard. Looks like it was when Lord Doa was still alive. Doa. I never met the man.
if that's the size of the model, I dread to think how big the real thing was. A marline spike. Clearly used with knots in some way. Let's see if this helps. Let me be wrong. Oh, Jesus Christ. What is going on up there, Mr. Collins? Uh, everything's fine. I tripped on something, is all. Maybe you should come back down before you. Not what I expected at all. Uh, just another moment, if you would. Very well. Lady Doa said they didn't have a child of their own. Lady Doa, you can go there. That's the room with the banging door. Lord Doa, well, that's where you go. That's the office I've just come from. Very detailed. Oh, Doa's hidden room. Genius. More interesting by the minute. This makes things quicker.
my dick. She's sitting on a gold mine. Money is clearly no motive here. Looks like an adoption form. A cryptex. Looks like I need an eight digit code to open it. I wonder what's hidden inside. I should probably go and talk to Lady Doa. It's jammed tight. Let's hope it's in the right place. All this hidden away in a box. It belongs in a museum. My lady, I've found this. What is it? I can't see it up there. It appears to be a cryptex of some kind. Oh. Yes. It's a silly old game I used to play with one of the maids. We would pass messages back and forth and have to figure out the code. It's been many years since I've seen that. I see. By any chance, do you still have the code for it? Couldn't tell you. Couldn't or won't? Mr. Conway, I think I've been very accommodating, all things considered. Well... Can you give me a clue? I can do one better. I can give you the cipher. Uh, please, do. On one condition. Dare I ask? It's not all that bad. There's a picture in the main hall. My late husband. I haven't seen his face in some time. Would you take a picture of him for me? Lady Doa, as luck would have it, I've already taken that picture. You have? And without my permission? I thought you wanted me to. Yes, yes. Very well. Here it is. We used an old code. You take the alphabet and write the first 13 letters under the next 13. Then replace the letter you have with the one underneath or above it. So... A would be an N, and D would be Q. That's right. Well, where do I find the code to translate? Mr. Conway, may I remind you that it's you up there and not I. I will say, though, the code was usually something to do with my late husband's model boats. Very well. I'll start looking around, then. So, the code is something to do with Lord Doa's boats.
one of Lord Doa's models. A man of talent. Jam tight. Let's hope it's in the right place. Another key. It's for the servants' quarters. Well, that's encouraging. Death's shadow. Innocence. Charlotte May. Lady Doa. I'm no expert, but that does not look good.
It appears she left in a hurry. Could be useful. It's a shame to damage something so beautiful. But I do want to open the box by the window. Oh, it could be useful. Long last. Now, what do you unlock? And why would the intruder hide you? Let's see what Lady Doa has to say about you. My lady, may I bother you again? Of course. I think I've found out what the intruder was doing. About time. Go on then. It's a key. Looks to be quite ornate. Go on. I was hoping you could tell me. Hmm. Describe it to me. Perhaps it'll jog my memory. It has a large anchor shape. Go on. It has a copper midsection. Ah, I know what that is. The basement storage key. Again, I haven't seen that for many years. I have one too somewhere. I could look for it. The basement, you say? Yes. Are you thinking what I'm thinking, Mr. Conway? I just might be. Do you think it possible that Charlotte May could be in your basement without you knowing it? The very thought of it. I fear there's only one way to find out. You'll have to go to the basement. The lift won't work whilst the stair lift is activated, though. Give me a moment. Ah. <sighs> Now, you really are alone up there, Mr. Conway. Can I just remind you that... Shh. 
What is it? Are you expecting anyone? <laughs> Another intruder, you mean? Lady Doa, I'm serious. Oh, my. I'll go and call the police. Shh! They've locked the door. I know you're here. Come out. You're not going to get away with this. Show yourself at, at once. You can't hide. Uh, my daughter is a police officer. You're clearly out of your depth. Please, if you're here, you don't... Locked. I'm coming, Charlotte. Mr. Conway, what on earth is going on? What is all that banging? I need your help. The kidnapper is down here. What? That's it. I'm calling the police. Oh, wait, no. I, I need to get into the basement. They took my key. Mr. Conway, are you insane? I'm calling the police, and that is the end of it. I think Charlotte May is here right now. Do you have that other key? Uh, I do. Toss it to me. Um, I don't know. Lady Doa, please. Fine. Got you. I said stop. God damn this bloody chair. Charlotte, give me 
me something. Were you here? There's something here then. There has to be. There'll be no explaining this to Kevin. After the attack against me in Lady Doa's home, I'm left questioning everything. Was it one of the McKees? Harold Levy? Or someone else? My presence is clearly getting to someone. Lady Doa was downstairs at the moment I was attacked. I can't rule her out. I need to be sure what her involvement was. Only a few questions remain unanswered. It is possible that Lady Doa and the intruder work together. Does anything here indicate that she could have helped the kidnapper? I should read every detail on the evidence. Good, I thought as much. Now to continue. Lady Doa clearly wouldn't have kidnapped Charlotte May for money. Why else would she want to steal a girl?
right, I'm onto something. Now, what does the rest of it mean? I need to look at every piece of evidence. There must be a detail I'm missing on some of the evidence. So, Lady Doa may have had motive after all. She lost a child and was clearly emotionally shaken by it. Though it seems like that was many years ago, and I found no evidence other than she knew how to tie knots. Not very conclusive, if I do say so. Shirley, on the other hand, was stealing from Lady Doa. She knew her way around the house and had access to many of the rooms. She also had a good view of Tony Morgan's house, and was talking about Charlotte May on the dictaphone message. Shirley, are you my attacker? Did you take Charlotte May? Robert Conway speaking. Dad. Uh, Catherine, uh, again, I I'm sorry Do that you... Do you know how foolish you made me look tonight? Uh, why don't you come over? I had to explain to my superior that my father was found in the same house that we think Charlotte May was tied up in. That the reason why we have no good footprints is because my father's tire marks are littered across an open crime scene. I'll be very surprised if I still have a job tomorrow morning. Uh, that wasn't my intention. No. You know full well why I had to. You can't just do whatever you want and think it won't affect other people. What if she'd press charges? Lady Doa gave me her permission. You could have ruined my case. It's not just your case. There are other ways to prove yourself. You can't be so blind as to think you can do it all on your own. The real test of one's character is learning when to ask for help. Jeez. And that's what you've been doing? Asking for my help? It seems as though you're hell-bent on being the one to find her. Well, the apple hasn't fallen far from the tree. No, it's still very much in the tree's shadow. What are we arguing about? We both care about Charlotte May. We both want to help Tony Morgan. It's my job to help Tony Morgan. What you've done is against the law. You, you said it yourself. There weren't any charges against me. Oh, you, you don't get it, do you? Your actions might have gotten Charlotte May killed. What if it was you down there? Hmm? Would you want me to stop? To respect people's privacy? 
to follow the law. That's not fair. Well, it's all I had. The vision of a young girl who needed my help. And all I saw was your face. Someone needed to do what had to be done, no matter the cost. But there's always a cost. Isn't there, Dad? 